Hello folks again. Uh, we have uh, 2018. Question of 2018, October, November, paper 13 and the question number is 13. So this uh, is about a force, uh, actually vectors also involved here. So it says that the diagram shows the zip of a crane, of a crane at an angle of 35 degree to the vertical here, to the vertical. A cable passes over a frictionless pulley and carries a load of 1830 newton so it is carrying a load of 1830 newton the force r that the pulley exerts on the cable pulley exerts on the cable is in line with the jeep so is it line with this thing this thing actually this is a straight line showing the, that that line the cable and the pulley are in equilibrium so that means the whole system is at rest neither performing acceleration linear or nor performing rotational rotational acceleration so what's the value of r so uh, this case is no, not so uh, difficult actually so since we have the tension here tension here is uh, uh, the load here is 1830 newton so that's why the tension here is also 1830 newton and the whole system is in equilibrium at rest so since there is no acceleration the tension and the uh, weight should be same so if the tension here is same through the pulley the same tension goes here also because the function of a pulley is to change the direction of the force it does not actually change the magnitude of the force so here also we will have this is also 1830 newton this force also so now uh, because of this the resultant here will be because of this force and because of this force the resultant here will be somewhat like this it will be equal to uh, component of this force in this direction plus component of this force in this direction so the result is equal to the sum of component of this force in this direction plus component of this force in this direction so its component is like this like this and its component is also somewhat like this so we have two things here one is the component of this force in this direction another is the component of this force in this direction so they are individually so the components are one component c1 is equal to one a three zero into cos of 35 degree and another of c2 its component will be equal to c2 equal to again 1830 cos of 35 degree so the total of these two which means the resultant is equal to c1 plus c2 and that's equal to 2 into 18230 into cos of 35 degree so this is the total force here and since the system is in equilibrium this force should be equal to this force so the resultant of these two things which acts here they should be equal to this so that means this uh, uh, this resultant should be equal to this whole thing so let me do it like this this resultant is rc rc so we must have this rc should be equal to r which means r should be equal to 2 into 18230 into uh, cos of 35 degree so this uh, value will uh, come out to be equal to uh, so overall so if i do the collection here in somewhere uh, outside uh, the field of view uh, 2 uh, into 18830 into uh, 35 cos so this thing comes out to be equal to about about 2998 newton which is nearly equal to 3000 newton and the answer is choice number D here. So choice number D is the correct answer.